everyone, I'm Rachel. I was introduced to Kiros in March 2019 and back then I was in the first trimester of my pregnancy. In September 2019, my son Justin was born and unfortunately in his first week of birth, he was diagnosed with BSD. Medical term-wise is known as ventricular septal defect and in layman term, it just means that he has a hole in his heart. Unfortunately, he doesn't just have one hole in his heart, he actually has two holes in his heart. And the one that is more serious is the one that is in the medium septum, which is in the wall, the muscular wall, that is separating the left side of the heart and the right side of the heart. And the, it's worrying for us because firstly, with his um, so-called pre-existing medical condition, we can't get any insurance coverage. Uh, so if he needs operation, then it will be really costly. So the doctor told us that since the hole is in a region where there is that where it's um, surrounded by muscles, then he would like to observe how the muscle will grow over the course of um, the year, uh, the months as Justin grows older. So as new parents, we were very concerned, and I shared my worries with Huang Ying. And she mentioned to me that Kiros has prior experience in healing babies and toddlers and even adults who has uh, who have hole in their hearts. So we decided to try every avenue out there and we seek, decided to seek treatment with Kiros. And thankfully Kiros agreed to heal Justin. So in our first telephone conversation, Kiros actually used uh, her abilities and her powers to channel an energy ball into Justin's heart. So when Justin turns one month old, we went for the second review and the doctor was glad to see that the hole in his heart actually closed by about 20 to 25%. The doctor feel that we can continue to be conservative in our approach and continue to monitor him down the road. But however, if the if there's still no sign, further signs of um, closing of the hole, then we may have to consider surgical uh, interferences or interventions. So with his advice, we decided to continue to seek treatment with Kiros. And true enough, when Justin turns six months old, February we went late February we went to see the doctor again for the third review, and. This time round, um, the holes in his heart actually closed significantly by 50 to 57 percent. And such numbers were very encouraging. Hence, the doctor told us that he doesn't require any form of surgery. And that was when he was only six months old. So he says that we can continue to monitor until he turns one. And hopefully, by then, um, you know, things may get better. From six months to when Justin turns one, we continue to uh, seek treatment with Kiros. And the good news was when Justin turns one, the hole in his heart has finally healed completely and the doctor discharged him of ESD. Till today, we are very grateful and thankful to Kiros for extending her help to us because she really used the energy within her to heal Justin. And I firmly believe that Kiros has played a very important role in healing our son. Kiros has always been a very caring and, cons uh, and kind individual and she always reminded people around her to do good and to avoid a sense like greed, jealousy, eventy. And one of the most important uh, message that she has been trying to uh, teach us is to avoid uh, consuming meat. So with her influence, she has changed me as well and I'm currently a vegan uh, for about close to five months and I think it was a drastic change. It's not as if I did it uh, one step at a time. I decided to do it overnight and I believe that it's possible because there are many sources of plant protein out there. So I highly and strongly encourage all of you out there to um, try to be a vegetarian. You don't even have to be trying that hard. You just have to make more uh, conscious decision on the kind of food that you want to consume or the kind of nutrients you want to feed your body. And I hope that um, with this video, uh, I can try to encourage some of you to at least practice uh, uh, being a vegetarian for a few days in a month.
and see how that helps you with your health and your well-being. And I think going on being a vegan, it actually helps to save the animals and also helps to conserve the resources that we have on Earth and make the Earth a better place for our future generations. Finally, I want to say thank you to Kiros for doing such a great job or uh, such a great favor for Justin. Uh, thank you. Bye-bye.